Right now, two gunmen who police say woke up a couple at gunpoint in their bedroom early yesterday morning are still on the loose. CBS 11's Brittany Jeffers is live near the busy shopping strip where one of the homeowners was taken to make a cash withdrawal. Brittany. Yeah, it was a very scary ordeal for that family in Fort Worth. And behind me is where the husband was taken, brought here to this ATM to take out some cash while his daughter and his wife stayed at the house with another gunman. Now, this all happened around 4 o'clock yesterday morning. Cynthia Prostrick and her husband say they woke up to find the two armed men inside of their bedroom. Those men at the time were demanding cash, and one of them then took Cynthia's husband to the bank at Hewlin and Bel Air to take out cash while Cynthia and her daughter stayed inside their home with another gunman. They tell us this whole ordeal lasted about an hour. Unfortunately, no one was hurt. Police say they don't know why this particular home on Riverbend Drive was chosen. They specifically told us that it was our cars in the front that made them choose our house. And they told us that if our door, if they had tried a door and it was locked, they wouldn't have broken in the door. Now, the family says their back door was unlocked and their home alarm wasn't on. Police do tell us that they plan to up patrols in the area while they continue to look for these two suspects. We are told one of them, they believe, is uh, late teens, early 20s. Meantime, surveillance video from the ATM or any surrounding businesses right now has not yet been released. Reporting live this morning in Fort Worth, I'm Brittany Jeffers, CBS 11 News.